more comfortable did you feel today kind of in the pocket but in general than you have the last few weeks? Yeah, um, that was one of the things we concentrated on this week, just me staying in the pocket more. And uh, I felt, I did feel a lot more comfortable. Um, the O-line did a great job uh, all week during practice. And, uh, they really proved themselves this week. Uh, I'm glad to have those guys up front, those front five. And, uh, they make our offense quick. First drive in the third quarter when you converted three third downs. The first one seemed to be particularly important. Yeah. But, but, can you, do you remember that pass to Darius? I think it was an out route, I believe. I can't remember. But, um, yeah, they, uh, they showed us a four across panel, which is they bring seven. Or bring, uh, yeah, bring seven. Um, anytime they do that, we, we got to uh, get out of that defense. Uh, we got to make them pay for bringing seven guys. Uh, only covered ours here before. It's, so we talked about all week, and we got kind of one of those. And then it, then it followed a couple of false start penalties. 14-14 you know, yeah. at the half, and you, and you guys were having a little bit of a hard time. Uh, that, did you have a feeling that that put you over the over the top there and then got that drive going? Uh, I, I just felt like it may have started clicking more. Mm -hmm. uh, you guys going on offense. Uh, I mean, that second half, I mean, we really showed what we can do, what we're capable of. Uh, we just got to do that in four quarters, 60 minutes. You've talked over the last few weeks about getting more comfortable. Is that something that, like you said, it needs to be done over a half or a whole game, or is it something where a big play like that long touchdown to Al can sort of click a lot of that in for you? Uh, it, it starts on the practice field. Uh, everything we do starts on the practice field. So me being comfortable in the pocket, being comfortable with my receivers and where they're breaking their routes, and, uh, it all starts at practice on the practice field. Uh, when we bring it out on Saturday, it's just kind of second nature. On the second scoring drive in the second half, the quick one where you started at midfield, uh, where you you got the 15 yard penalty to get uh, yeah. get out of bounds. Were you about to slide on that and, and stayed up? Or what? I wasn't expecting to hit me. So I was running out of bounds to kind of that I was going out of bounds. Uh, but he stayed up the play and uh, kind of wrapped me around the neck and put me in a little bit of a headlock there for a little bit. But, uh, but were you going to gonna slide. slide first, or no? I was trying to get out of bounds just to pick up the first down and uh, just go out good. I uh, wasn't really expecting him to put me in a chokehold. How much comfortable are you with Al? I mean, it, it, you know, Santino really show up today, but is that something that's been clicking a little more in well, practice of late? I mean, everybody knows Al has speed, and uh, we really executed on that this week. Uh, we wanted to get back on that this week. We know uh, if we get 24 involved in the game, it's going to create opportunities for the other receivers as well. So. Uh, and they had some mismatches where uh, they put two guys on out, and then we had to come back to Cole and Darius and Brad and Keenan. Uh, and we just got to make them feel uncomfortable. Uh, put two guys on out, and it opens up opportunities for the guys. Anything else for Kyle? Thank you very much.